Hey everybody, what's happening? Son of a Silver Stacker here. In today's numismatic news and information for the 5th day of June 2022, I'd like to welcome you over to Atmex and show you where the spot prices ended the week on Friday. However, before I do that, I'd like to welcome you to tomorrow's shows. And that's a good morning to you with Tiny Numismatics, number 156. And 25 minutes later or so, we're going to be having Man Killer Monday, and that's a special... Uh, early release and celebration of the Wilma Mankiller Quarter, and we're going to be covering that and making uh, live comments as it goes down. It's going to be beautiful. It's going to be amazing, so I hope to uh, find you there. Now, should be a third one here, and that's going to be the drop, I believe, on Tuesday afternoon at 11.40 a.m., 8.40 p.m. Uh, 8 40 a.m pacific time we're going to be covering the proof set for the american innovation dollars so let's go ahead and talk about that today but before we do that let's head over to atmex now it looks like gold was down 1750 to 1859 even silver down 34 cents to 22.16 platinum down seven dollars 70 cents to 1036.70 and palladium down 73.70 73.50 to 20.11 even steven check that out that's pretty incredible now over here to the united states mint that's our next stop and we're going to be looking at well the american innovation 2022 one dollar coin proof set however before that i just want to let you know that the american eagle that dropped last week that 2022 one ounce silver uncirculated coin Product 22 EG is still available, right? I think they have about 12 to 13,000 coins still left. And yes, the United States Mint did take off that household order limit of three at noon the following day. So the question is, what's going on here? Are we back to having the American Silver Eagle inventories last for months and months, if not uh, over a year? I think so. I think times have changed uh, a little bit here with the American Silver Eagles and um, and you know one coin does not make a trend right but I think that proof out of San Francisco um, I think that's probably going to sell out way faster than this uncirculated coin now let's talk about that American innovation coin proof set now this will drop in two days from now June 4, uh, 7th 2022 at noon and we will be covering this release the product is $24 no mentions limit no product limit Household order limit of none. However, if you look at the view page source, you're seeing here that the data available suggests there's 102,160 of these particular sets going to be available. Now, the Mint could easily add more to this particular number, and that would not be surprising. However, given um, everything that's happened this year, I still think it is the year of the limited release, so they may not be adding more to that. And these products are going to be minted out of the San Francisco Mint on top of all that. So, um, there's a theory that something else is going on at the San Francisco Mint, and I don't want to get into that just yet. Maybe we'll talk about it tomorrow morning now, it says here. The American Innovation $1 coin proof set features four stunning coins with sharp relief and a mirror-like background with frosted foregrounds, giving them a special cameo effect with reverse, that's tails designs, for emblem... Um, designs emblematic of the following states innovation or innovators right there's four coins every year and this is going to go till 2032 started in 2018 first coin this year was uh dropped was the rhode island coin featuring uh nathaniel hershoff's reliance yacht and that one you can see here um, next coin was the vermont snowboarding coin then the kentucky uh bluegrass um music coin and then the tennessee valley authority coin and these are all minted at san francisco they are accompanied by a certificate of authenticity we don't know who's going to be signing that one whether it's um david j Ryder, allison dune or miss ventress gibson right so we're definitely going to be finding out what's going on there and check this out the back of the packaging it doesn't even have the picture of the coins it just has drawings of the coins so i thought that was really interesting so if you're not sure about or if you're not um i guess aware of what the american innovation coins are here's a quick description and i think the united states mint really pays a lot of attention to the tennessee valley authority coin and i'm not sure why but i'll show you what what's going on and what made me think of that now it says here the american innovation one dollar coin program is a multi-year series featuring distinctive reverse that's the tales designs that pay homage to america's ingenuity and celebrate the pioneering efforts of individuals or groups from each of the 50 states district of columbia and united states territories now it says here i got something to follow up with this once i read this paragraph one of the nation's greatest strengths is its entrepreneurial spirit and the remarkable innovation and discovery it unleashes now the united states mint is proud to celebrate innovation and honor the spirit of america with the 2022 american innovation one dollar coin proof set now it says um here in that first sentence that one of the greatest strengths of our nation is its entrepreneurial spirit and the remarkable innovation and discovery it unleashes now i think that is um due to the fact that in this country 
we really celebrate the individual, not the group, right? Well, that may be changing, but in the initially, we really celebrated the individual and the individual accomplishments and so on and so forth, right? So a lot of people just came up with these most amazing ideas. Now, collective societies, they don't have as many, um, they don't have that strength of entrepreneurial spirit, right? And the remarkable innovation and discovery. Um, but there are remarkable um, knowledge sharing bases now. That's a whole different video for another day, maybe even another channel. Let's get on to this. Um, like I said here, um, now here it says here's the 2022 American Innovation $1 coin proof set features coins with the following designs, right? We have the Rhode Island coin, we have the Vermont coin, Kentucky, and Tennessee. Now they all fall within the bullet points, but check this out. The Tennessee coin falls outside the bullet points. In fact, I think here would have been probably a good location to talk about the enrollment subscriptions, right, for the, for the particular coin. But look at this. It says here, uh, after the bullet point, as a Late as the mid-1930s, 90% of rural homes were without electricity. In 1933, the Tennessee Valley Authority was created to address the, uh, ten the Tennessee Valley's most important issues in energy and environmental development. Isn't that interesting? They keep going, keeping on with that one. Now, it says here, the coin is a $1 coin. It's a proof finish. Composition, 6% zinc, 3.5% manganese, 2% nickel, and the remaining balance is going to be copper. Weighs 8.1 grams. Its diameter is 1.043 inches. That's 26.49 millimeters, right? It's got the lettered edge, and there are some errors, I imagine, going to be happening on these particular coins. Now, it is minted in San Francisco. Maybe not the proofs, but definitely um, that lettered edge from Denver and Philadelphia. Now, and it has a gear mark, and the gear mark changes every single year. And here it is right there. You can see this one is probably the most, um, has the most teeth of any of the gears so far. And I would expect next year's gear to have far fewer teeth now going to go on to the mintages right so it says no mintage limit no product limit no household order limit and it does drop in two days and look at this it says it has 102,160 now how does that stack up to last year's right so let's go to the American Innovation Coin from 2021 no mintage limit no product limit no household order limit now it says here there's 44,160 of these available now you combine with what they have right there in front of us 44,160 and what they've already sold were the 122,000, right? Now, 122,000 is definitely 20,000 higher than what we're seeing here. Now, let's go on to the next year. And that's the American Innovation Coin from 2020. And that is a proof set. And it is still $24. And if you look at the numbers, however, look at that. Bam! 556. Now, you know, if you've seen any of the videos in the last couple of days when I went over the mintages and the sales over at coinnews.net, you'll see that easily... The American Innovation products were moving 600 to 500 per week, right? So how long does this last now if these are selling at 500 per week? Are these even going to hang out or, or be around even for next weekend? Probably not, I would think. Now, going to go on to 2019. And I think 2019 um, definitely um, is a great year to have. It's, it's, it's the full first year of all four coins, right? Uh, thing is, with this, they made a tremendous amount of them. It was before, you know, what happened in 2019. And I think that when they initially um, started this set, they, they were going to go gonzo with it and produce a tremendous amount of coins. And then since 2020 happened, they had to reevaluate everything. And we're like, yeah, this set's probably not going to be as prominently featured at, at the mints. And we're probably not going to devote a whole lot of resources as we were. In fact, we saw the packaging for the American Innovation reverse proof coins get stuck into a, um, a set like this, four coins and a lens. Um, you know, and that was a kind of a bummer in the summer. Uh, because everybody really liked the packaging on that, and it did have an uh, opportunity to make that packaging where it had all four coins in that, um, kind of innovative, but, you know, still a little bit of a miss right there. But so let's check out the numbers here for the 2019. Here we are. Look at that, 84,540 left. So that's a tremendous number, and really it's consistent with 2019. Like I said, 2019, the Mint was still making tremendous amount of those particular coins. Now let's go here to coinage.net. There's an article by Mike Unser, June 2, titled U.S. Mint Sales Reverse Proof Innovation $1 Rise. And I'm going to go straight to the clad sets. Now we talked about the um, numbers for this particular set, right, for the 2022 coin proof set. And the numbers are right here, 102, 160, right? So 141, 600, 105, and that one is still for sale. Um, like I said, uh, they have 122 possible. And then last year, no, 122, no, 
there's 500 left of these? Yeah, 500 left of these, which is 106,000, right? And then, uh, what was it here? 77,000 on top of that one. I apologize that I'm getting mixed up on my numbers. That's a 2022. Here we go, 2021. Like I said, 44,000 left. Tremendous number, 44,000 left on top of that. So that puts us at that 122. So 122 here, 141 here, and these are still for sale. However, the other one that is not for sale, and I think people need to know and recognize, is that 2020 set for the American Innovation Dollars, right? That's the one with the um, Massachusetts telephone coin. Yeah, that's going to be probably the lowest mintage um, of all of the, um, compared to this one, right? Bam, 102, 160. So that's going to be the one, I think, 102, 160, because I think next year they turn it up. So this year and last year for the proof sets, I think, are the ones to own. Whew. Wow, I can't believe I got through that. Thanks for hanging out this long. Um, I wanted to show you, though, one last thing about these particular sets for 2022. It's basically a wasteland for the 2022 American Innovation Proof Set. Nothing going on here. Look at that. That's a bundle, 2018, 2019, 2020, 2021, and 2022 for just under $100. Now you're going to go try and look for these? No. They're not even available. Like I said, it's a wasteland. Nothing going on. So it'll be interesting to see what if these do even come up for sale. Now to the plus twos today. Bam! Look at that. It's a song by The Cure. It's called Love Song. And the lyrics are on the screen. And it's probably one of the most beautiful songs they did ever in the history of ever. And now for the plus two. Boom! And Frank said this. Look at how a single candle can both defy and define the darkness. Right? Think about that. One lone candle can define and defy the darkness. I think that gives us all hope, right? Gives us all a feeling that um, we're not so weak. Uh, if one candle can do that in a room full of darkness, what can we do if we shine bright? Yeah, that's right. And if we can ignite somebody else's candle, imagine what that room would look like. Um, I don't think there would be any darkness um, and we would all be defying and defining that darkness. So there it is, folks. I want to thank you all for watching. Thanks for dropping by. Don't forget to hit that like button. And if you do like what you're going to see, please subscribe to the channel. It's free. Son of a Silver Stacker, out.